when, when Central Lincoln was looking for uh, AMI systems, uh, we knew that this was a, a major expenditure for us, and it's probably kind of a one-time expenditure, and that was we wanted to pick the best system that would provide us as multiple benefits. Now, uh, we've adopted this, this smart grid uh, uh, concept, which is effectively, it's, it's more than just getting reads from a meter. Uh, it provides us about the, the system health uh, in terms of from our substations. Now we can see how, our, how healthy is our system all the way to a meter. Um, we wanted to use uh, this AMI system, Gridstream, to, uh, for multiple purposes. Uh, to not only get meter reads, but also to look at what is the voltage level at the customer's uh, uh, service, service drop. And is there a way that we can do conservation voltage reduction uh, to maximize the benefit? And we are using that. And we're using that communication network that, uh, that the Gridstream has provided us uh, to be able to do a variety of different things. Uh, uh, another one is uh, distribution automation. Uh, we're deploying, at this point, we're just doing it on a pilot basis. We're putting uh, smart devices out there, uh, fault uh, locators uh, um, uh, and uh, reclosers. And so we're able to use the communication network that we're installing for our AMI system to do distribution automation and to do uh, conservation voltage reduction. Our service territory is on the central Oregon coast. Um, and we're about 140 miles long and we're pretty pretty skin, a skinny service territory and uh, uh, we get hit with a lot of storms we get a real corrosive environment because of the salt air and we have mountains too uh, and so it's it's we did not think uh, an RF mesh system would work and it really it took Landis and Gear to come in and help us uh, put our system together and right now uh, the confidence level is very very high that this system is going to work and it was just a great decision for us to move down this path. Again, it, it, it comes down to, with an RF mesh system, uh, you have a lot of room for expansion. You're not up to the technological limit of that system. Uh, and so, uh, you know, for us, uh, you know, for us to uh, move down that path was, was really a great decision and we're really helpful at Landis Gear. Helped us with kind of the initial scoping. Uh, and they've helped us all along the way in terms of, of, of deploying our, uh, locating our routers and, and deploying our meters. And so far, we're, we're just very, very pleased with it. We're getting very, very high uh, reads, uh, high percentage reads. Uh, again, 99.9% .9 load profile reads at this point. And we're very optimistic it's going to continue.